what? What'd you just say? You had LSD? Did I just interrupt a drug deal? What are you talking about? Yo, you got, I don't know if you can see, but I just, he said I had LSD and then he has ranch sauce, like all. So I don't know if he meant when he went to Canada or currently he had, this is Pioneer Square, anything's possible. I've seen a lot of crazy shit outside. You guys have 4,000 homeless people out there. It's like The Walking Dead upstairs. That's <laughs> why so we're down here, we're safe. They lock the doors, we giggle for a minute, and then we go back up. Try to get back to our families. But we hydroplane, and then that's when they get us. Started as one homeless dude, and then he bit somebody. And then... It's just a cycle. I've been on stage for a few minutes. If you've seen it, I have Tourette Syndrome. It's why I blink real fast, I twitch, my head flops around. I've had my whole life, it's kind of cute. <laughs> 28 years. It's weird. It always looks like I'm trying to tell you a secret. <laughs> She's very <laughs> This twitch gets me in trouble. My roommate came home from work. I was like, dope. <laughs> Our neighbor died. <laughs> he said, did you kill him? <laughs> I was like, nah. <laughs> he was on LSD. He had to go. <laughs> Too much goddamn ranch sauce on his face. He didn't know how to eat chicken wings. It pissed me off. <laughs> so you know you're on LSD when you can't eat a goddamn chicken wing. That's the easiest thing to eat. It's the finger food you put in your mouth. He's like, no, but no. How do I get it in my mouth? Oh, that's a level of God. That's a weird moment to be telling a story in the biggest plate of nachos. Be careful. This guy's gonna come and just throw him on his face. <laughs> He'll bring ranch. It'll be in his beard. That's where he keeps it. <laughs> ranch was playing Plinko in his beard. <laughs> Just so, uh, so are you, uh, are you texting people? You're looking at the most recent Shots Fired incident? <laughs> I inspired you to do research? <laughs> I've never had that happen where I've told a joke and he's like, well, I'm gonna fact check it. <laughs> I don't know about this guy. <laughs> oh, it was down south? Oh, okay, good. Yeah. Thanks, man. <laughs> well, this, uh, this went from a comedy show to a town hall meeting real fast. <laughs> How do we fix Seattle? <laughs> We're gonna be fine, it's south. We have time. We have time, but the White Walkers we need to fix immediately. And I don't know if you know this, but there's somebody among us on LSD. You'll know him, because there's zero ranch on his chicken fingers, but a lot on his body. <laughs> yeah, this dude has 35 napkins, what is that? Like, oh, where did your girl, did you eat her? What the fuck happened? <laughs> LSD is strong. I did not see her leave. Something happened. And we need to get to the bottom of this shit. Do some goddamn research. And look up what the fuck happened to his girl. It's fine, she's in the south, so. She went south. <laughs> Oh, weird. Is she okay? All right. Is she also on LSD? She'll be back. <laughs> that did not answer my question at all. <laughs> she on drugs, she'll be back. You 
guys can ask me anything you want. The more you ask, the more fun it's gonna be. I don't get offended about shit. I had a feeling you would be the first. <laughs> Yo, even if you didn't raise your hand, I was gonna be like, could you start us off? Because I feel like you have a question on your phone. Why did you bring that beer out if you weren't gonna drink it? Why'd I bring this beer out if I wasn't gonna drink it? Uh, well, because I'm up here trying to do a goddamn job. I don't know why I brought it on. But I feel like you just disrespected me. You want me to drink it? All right. No, I'm not gonna, no, 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 I'm not 13, okay? This, I'm not gonna try to try out for a goddamn fraternity. I'm not chugging this, hit chug it, and then walk on the knives. Cheers. Can everybody else cheers so it's not like we're on a first day? Cheers, thanks for coming out, everybody. <laughs> he just lifted more ranch and threw it on his <laughs> Can I get you a waitress down here? <laughs> Look, bitch, I don't work here. I'm just trying to... <laughs> the manager. I can take another sip of my beer for you. Pretty good. Uh, yeah, wait, uh, if they can get a waitress. <laughs> uh, yeah, went from comedy show, town hall meeting, and now I'm host at this restaurant. It's great. My parents are gonna be way more proud of this job. <laughs> what do you need? Some cutlery? <laughs> She thinks she's at Ruth Chris right now. Some cutlery. Yo, they have nachos and chicken wings. You do not need cutlery. The two things on the menu. Some cutlery. She said that like we're not underground right now. You use your hands. You need a fork? Cutlery. Say cutlery and a drink. You got a drink? Okay, he got you. All right, cool. Anybody else need anything? Can I can I valet anybody's car? Or... Thanks, man. Can we get this guy some cutlery so we can learn how to fucking eat? Yeah. On a scale from one to five, how weird is this show? Uh, it's Seattle. It's a solid Seattle. Yeah, I'd give it a five. Whatever the weirdest end of that is, that number. Now, I've never heard the word cutlery used in a comedy club in my life. Yep, that's a saying. <laughs> what a weird night. You know what's so? You know what's a weird night when I thought the weirdest thing was gonna be that dude saying he was on LSD, and then the fact that Cutlery beat that is really fucking with me right now. And that I honestly don't know if I work here now or not. <laughs> Part of me is like, I feel like I'm still a comedian, and I, I this is my dream, but I will probably put together some of the furniture when you guys leave. I'm gonna bust these tables. All your glasses, all your nacho chips, or cutlery, everything. You leaving, you okay? Yeah, I'm gonna get some more <laughs> <laughs> Yo, he thinks he's the coolest he's ever been. You didn't see the way he left like fucking Tom Cruise just just fucking deuces up. That was pretty good. It was pretty good. It was pretty good. I have a witty response, but I'm a waiter here now, so I don't know. this isn't even my job anymore.